Hi everyone, welcome to Lovey Life! My name is Victoria, this is my wife Regina and this is our sunny boy Please subscribe to his channel Like a snake And if you saw us, I'm not sure how many days ago on our second channel, vlogging channel, we have daily vlogs now you already saw my Costco haul and now and we're going to eat it! Now we're going to eat it! But whoever doesn't um, see the um, other channel, because some people don't. So we, yeah, we so can go and is, check our home. This is not Costco exactly home, but it's food that I bought in Costco. And we really love this food. Explain what we have anyway. Obviously. Oh my god, it's out of the frame. You have to put it in the frame. And go check our second channel, please. Oh. please and subscribe. And <laughs> yeah. thank you so much. Yeah, it's called Family Daily so. Fun. Family Daily Fun. Fun. So this is, we have smoke, cold smoked salmon. This is European one, we love European salmon. Oh, Obviously right? cream cheese. And this is island farm cream cheese. If you are not Canadian, probably you don't know this one. Mm. But flavor wise, I think this is the tastiest cream cheese out there. And I really, really, really love this cream cheese. I miss you too. <laughs> What it is here? Uh, vegetables, tomatoes, Tom cucumbers, and onions. And onions. Did you show, show the croissant? No, I haven't. Oh, oh. The main dish of the evening. The this croissant. Is, this is buttery cross crescents. Oh. Crescents or croissants? Sure. Anyway. Uh, hummus. Uh. Favorite one. This is your favorite, isn't it? Yeah, one of them. Actually, and provolone. How are we Por Porval Cheese. Porvalone cheese. Porvalone. Because here I don't think you see it, but we have George, George Foreman and I'm going to cook it. With the toaster. No, you toaster. can't see it. Sorry. You can see that, but I have but here. But we have a toaster here. Toaster George Foreman. And it's really nice. And Porvalone has the most um, melting abilities to the cheese. That's. And I add like two in each. And this one. is. <laughs> a salad. Salad. Very heavy one. And we're drinking some water. And we're drinking some water. We're usually not drinking anything else. Mostly. Actually, with you, you drink coffee. <laughs> and you're starting to like tea way more. Yeah. For, for the past few days, you were drinking tea more than you drink coffee. Yeah, it happens to me a lot sometimes when I'm sick. And if you see how awesome, awesome, awesome. This is like, yeah. yeah. Do it with this one. Hi. There's your fork. It's hard for me to use a fork. With with salmon. You can try. You can try. <laughs> potato salad. Let's try. Who wants potato salad? Let's try. Yeah. Awesome. You see? Yeah. <laughs> almost. No. Almost. 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 <laughs> almost. Almost. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah. You can. You can do it. It's just hard because I don't want to get too much. Since I don't like the brown, it's, it's okay, but you can try to do it. You want this with porvolone, yes? Mm hmm. Oops. And you want potato salad? No, I don't actually. What? I don't want it now. Two pieces. Mm. Yeah, I know that you love two pieces. And it's go. You see, he doesn't like any additives, no nothing, just uh, porvolone and um, uh, crescent, and it goes to warm uh, panini press. It's George Foreman press. What's the difference between George Foreman? It's not uh, just the brand that it does uh, panini presses. What do you want? And why do you keep saying it? Panini? You like that? You I like really that? like George Foreman actually. Um, I don't know what I want. I know what I want. Tell me some cream cheese and some salmon. I had uh, another uh, butter knife salmon here. Somewhere. I love cream cheese. It's my favorite. I wanted to know. There you go. Mm. Take it with your knife. Put it in here. Take the knife. You know. You can do it. The knife for what? For tomatoes. Not on that, the fork for tomatoes, okay. sorry. I was confused. Yeah. And I'm making 
to myself sandwich, obviously. So cuke is going in. Onion goes into. There is onion hey, here. Are you guys gonna add salmon inside? Oh mm -hmm. yeah. I love onion rings. Do you like the onion ring? I'm going to do the same. Co I love onion. Copycat. Well, tomatoes. Well, at least you don't disagree with copycats. Yeah. I don't care. I'm just not going to put tomato, I think. Everybody that follow a and recipe so. should be co called copycats because, well, they follow yeah. a recipe. Uh, onion. Ooh. And then salmon. On top. There you go. That's how it looks. And some salmon. Ah, oh, no. now people need to see how it looks. This is how you do it. Why so much salmon sticking? Because I have a lot of filling inside, fill levels inside. Mm. How much salmon did you put? What? How much salmon? A lot. Yeah. I love a lot of salmon. So yeah, bon appetit. Mm. You're a salmon lover. You know that. Can I have my hummus, please? There you go. Thank you. The only thing, I will close mine. Can you open it? Perfection. Oh, sure. Mm. What is it? Mm. Oh my god, it's like lifting weights, those packages from I Costco. Think I, need, I need to add more things. More onion. <laughs> I love a lot of. Uh, so, ah, ah, I know. I, I, know I love a lot of. Um, Literally. Oh, you see? This. Oh. My god, I can just blow it too. Is mm. it on the I think you're good. Um, pepper, I don't like pepper. Want this? Yeah. Mm. You pepper? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Why are you talking about pepper? This pepper. On hummus. On hummus. Pepper. Oh. I got confused. Mm. Wait a second. I really don't want spiciness. It's not spicy. But I really don't want it. I don't like it too much. Can I move your water? Yeah. I can just ask it. I had to take the heat of the... Um, how it's called? Josh Foreman? How it? Mm. Is that the name of the toaster or? The toaster. Oh, mm. that's why you kept saying that. Mm. Mm. Um. Regina, it's wonderful. Yeah, I feel like I'm missing. It's one, one of my favorite. One. What? Oh, I need. Make more onion and salmon. You can't have too much salmon, Victoria was right. No, you can't. I surely can. Mm. Mm hmm. It's a much as but I broke it in. Mm hmm. Isn't good? Mm hmm. What's your favorite out of all this? This is the best sandwich ever. What's your I'm... favorite food of all this? Yes. Mm. And separately? <laughs> Salmon? No, I meant like... Salmon, listen. Probably salmon. And tomatoes. No. Obviously. Mm. The bun more than tomato? The croissant? Mm -hmm. Croissant, croissant, For whatever. me? No, for him. Really? Mm. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's salmon. I love the salmon. Yeah. I love the salmon, actually. Ah. What you had for dinner today? Let us know. What kind of sandwiches do you like? What is your favorite sandwich? In Israel, in Aroma, with halomi cheese. Halomi cheese. Have you ha ever had the halomi cheese? Link before. From Aroma. Uh, let, uh, let us know. From Aroma. Mm -hmm. That's my favorite. Aroma? That's, um... Like Starbucks in Canada, or like 
Tim Hortons, I guess. Well, this kind of. I think they have aroma in uh, Montreal on the other side. Montreal, no. you mean? Montreal. I, I know that they have aroma in Montreal and in, the, in um, Toronto. Toronto for sure. So they have like like um. But I'm not sure they have a hello um, sandwich here. No, bro. no, no. So they have a bunch of sandwiches. They bake fresh mm. breads um, like every, every day, and they have like uh, ice coffees and stuff. Um, coffees, some ice coffees, ice yeah. coffees, um, baked stuff. And remember when we were in Israel last time, we had or uh, carrot juice, mm -hmm. freshly squeezed carrot juice. That's from the same place. I love freshly squeezed carrot juice. Oh, I should. I, we should do some. Yes, we should. We have a... Um, we have juicer. Juicer. Do we have carrots? No, we need we more carrots. Not enough. Where, where? Oh my god, it sounds like you. Oh, no. Where, where? <laughs> They're learning from me. Oh, no kidding. Oh, I totally want carrot juice now. <gasps> Where's my water? I said I move it to you, so if you want to just ask. Oh, yes. Mm. Oh my goodness. This sandwich is huge. Mm -hmm. You guys are enjoying it. So I love that sandwich. Mm -hmm. I love that sandwich. I think so. Probably out all of them. What's your? This one? No, that one. What's your favorite sandwich of all time? That includes burgers. Oh, I love that sandwich. Okay, it's my like ultimate favorite. Like I have salmon sandwiches. Um, burgers. No, which is your favorite? Um, like, what is your favorite? Because I did. I didn't understand what is oh. your favorite. So this is like. How do you explain that cheese? Halloumi cheese, it's very dense cheese. Mm -hmm. It doesn't melt well. You can fry it actually or deep fry it. And it has squeakiness to it. It's Greek in origin, I think. You know, and um, it's very dense. And you can fry it and you can deep fry it. Yeah, and you get like slices, you know, like tofu slices kind of, so the same, like just a bit smaller. It seems like tofu slices. They do. But way better. Tofu right. doesn't come in comparison. Even though I love tofu, but there, yeah, is, but but there is a limit. It got to a different level. Yeah. So that's how that. And I and my. So that's that type of cheese. And we fry it and make it on the white fresh bread. They make it and put some. I don't remember what the, uh, it's going in. I don't remember what. <laughs> Tomato. Probably. I don't know. Lettuce. My goodness! I need a reminder. We have to go back we and check. We need to go check. I have a memory lapse. It was like. Last time we've been there, probably what, five years five ago? Years ago. I was only two years old. No, four. No, five, five. I was no? only two years old. No, you're five, you were in kindergarten. No, so I might be about four years old. No, no you were just more of this? Over the same sandwich. If it was four years ago, I must be four, so I'm nine right now. So it was like... <coughs> so it was four years ago. Four years ago. Yeah. And I would be five years old. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. It was four years ago. It was ago. four years ago. You were five. In, in this time, around this time, I think it was. We went in uh, March. Or March. Sure. Yeah. But we've been, you know, been in March. Ooh, good. Wow, only, only four. It feels... Four. Really? Four? Yeah, he was four. Yeah, it was five. Four years ago. Why oh. five? No, he was five it, four he years ago. He was four. Oh my goodness, it felt like it was way longer. <laughs> Oh yeah. Only four years, eh? Oh yeah. Wow. Only 20 years ago. Hmm. I thought at least like six. Anyway. Yeah. Anyhow. And my favorite sandwich is actually those kind of sandwiches. <laughs> I love. Yeah, but they have the one in croissant. And they have... Um, Sabi. Yeah, they have like eggplant egg there. Plants. And then they have egg. Boiled egg in there. It was, no, it was cheese turn off. Tur turn off? Turn off? It's barracas. Cheese barracas. It's called in the, in the Hebrew. With a bunch of stuff inside there. Was that plant, boiled egg? egg. A boiled egg, a tahini, um, cucumber, I think, uh, olives. 
like you know crushed or uh, olives and it was awesome as well oh but i think that if if i will go of check i know the most favorite it's always will be with the salmon salmon and they have the best um toasted bagels mm. in israel they have okay. a bagel they cut it for you and they put like olives in there and they put uh, corn if you corn want. in there and different stuff and which and it's just fabulous like those Bagels are the best. We should do bagels. Um, can I say them? Mm. Yeah. You guys say, oh, we didn't have much food back in your time, but when you say it, it's like more than 300 different foods, and you didn't even tell me all of them. No, we're talking about we didn't have um, food when we were, no, in, food uh, when we were in Ukraine, in USSR, when we were before age of uh, 10. That's what we're talking. But we still had food because we still have food, but I would say, but sugar. How bread you would get by coupons per family members and those kind of things. So you couldn't just go to the store and buy, you know, like sausages or anything like that. And how did you get food? Well, <laughs> it's all gold by the people who, who you your know. family knew. Yeah. If you got lucky, someone worked in the restaurant. And they could sneak out. Like it was a little bit, yeah. My grandpa was a butcher, so, so would he... always have meat and stuff. My dad was um, traveling and fixing like fridges for you know, like different companies and stuff, like electronic wise. He was bringing like stuff home as well. So it's all about pretty much the connections you had. Mm -hmm. Wow. The same is with your family, right? Yeah, and if you have, like my grandmother was working as a... Um, Why is it happening? Well, I... You can have a bottle. Have. Hmm? No, uh, no, I just seen it. No, I don't want it. I just seen it. Like, why is there happening? My grandma worked in... Um, um, Sud. Um, is that Prabhakta? Probably, Your grandma? Yeah. My grandma. My son, I have my no idea how to translate that. And, and, um, what did your grandma work like in? A court, court for for small disputes, like in disputes. Uh, in disputes? How disputes. 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 Okay. What did yeah, your yeah, mom work in? Mom, mom didn't work until we came to to Canada, to Israel. So she worked in the court for small disputes. Disputes. And she had to go to the people's houses, and those are usually what the, weren't inside the city, it was on the skirts outside of the city. They had bigger houses, and usually it's the problem that they had to, you know, they, they took over on each other's. Um, Property. property is not uh, property is the land. land and she had to figure out how much each of them have to you know have the land of their own or what is the city's limits because sometimes people was were taking like you know cities um, and the using those extra chunk of land and extra chunk of land and etc so she went there and because she went there she could buy a lot of homemade Food like homemade hams, homemade sausages, homemade just meat. <coughs> because she knew a lot of people there. So we got lucky and she had like her best friend living there. She always they always had some animals in their uh, you know. And every time they made sausages she got like she was buying it from them. Not that she wasn't buying, but you had to know someone who does it. Yeah. So if you don't know anyone, mm. so it's very hard to come by with uh -huh. good food or any yeah. kind of food yeah. for this matter. Barely bread. Yeah, but I was in Ukraine, sweetie. When we came to Israel, there were tons of stuff. Mm. Like it, it was cultural shock. Shock, yeah. actually. Like that you go to supermarket, it's like here. Have tons yeah. Of food. When mama, my, when my mom comes here, she always like uh, surprises that it's all small. Um, small village the all the world is small village because we have the same brands the same things the same basically okay. Okay. 
that answers your question, sweetie? Yep. Same Skippy. Skippy. This is Skippy. Is that a peanut butter? Skippy. Yeah. Skippy. Yeah, peanut butter. Yeah. Are you stuffed? Mm. What? Hi, cutie. Hmm. That sandwich was huge. I know. There were a lot, a lot. You ate potato salad, which I didn't. Oh, that's right. I did. And not so little. Okay, one spoon. She loves potatoes. I what do you know? Salad. She loves potatoes. Yeah. I find Costco potato salad is nice. It's Swedish. But it's a bit on the Swedish side. Like the pickles inside are kind of sweet, sweet and over mayoed a bit. Then why are you eating it? Because she loves it. Because I like it. I eat it like once an hour. Blue moon, but Blue yeah. moon. And that's okay, I won't be eating it for a long time now. This is the best sandwich ever. You're missing a salmon inside. It will come. As a wrap. I was going to say you're going to wrap it. <laughs> I'm going to wrap it. Wrap it like a present. Oh yeah, I love it. It's so funny when you said that because your grandma was working and stuff, she knew People. blah blah blah, but she said we got lucky. And I'm like, and it's kind of funny because mm. we got lucky. Yeah. Actually, <laughs> got lucky. We got lucky because lucky is our pet snake. So we got lucky. We did get lucky as our pet snake. So it's kind of funny we got lucky. Anyhow. Yeah, so we got lucky. Like, it depends. If, if your parents knew a lot of uh, people around, mm -hmm. you could get around. But if not, and I knew few people that could. And the scary part out of this, I could never, never, ever say that we have food at home or we have a lot of food at home or something. It was very scary. Yeah, I can't believe that we're... Why couldn't you? We the other foods. homes didn't have mm -hmm. food? No, because you just go buy coupons, get whatever. Like, if you go to the store, there's pretty much, like, there's nothing. Pretty much. Certain Even things, but not... My grandmother, the other one, she always, she always had family in the, you know, outskirts of Dnepropetro, so outside of Dnepropetro, where, where they have always had some properties. Sorry. And they always, um, you know, had the gardens and um, peppers and tomatoes and whatnot. Cucumbers. If you guys are gonna keep the name, then probably. Okay. I think I'm done. Cucumbers and etc. Let me finish and we will done. Yes, oh. really? Let me finish. It's kind of nice when you know no, someone miss, else talk if you no, just. No, I'm just wondering if you're like still eating. No, I'm good. <laughs> so, yeah. It's cucumber. I love cucumbers. So, she always got a good um, amount of vegetables and etc. So, she always pickled and preserved them. That's why I love preservation and pickles and pickled stuff. And she always did, you know, she had, always when I, uh, when I went to sleep over with her, it was usually once a month at least, she always opened me her uh, pantry and she, has, she had a big pantry, like walk-in pantry. Not, it wasn't huge, but it was like for me as a child, it was huge. And it was all, <coughs> all this, lots and lots and lots of pickled stuff and things. So she's, she said every time, you can choose two jars for the weekend to open. And it was like, oh, what I want to open today? What is this and what is it? And she did so many and so different things that until this time, <coughs> I, I can imagine how many things she did every year. Yeah, yeah, no. P pickled and preserves were a big, 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 big deal. We <coughs> all had huge choice. closets and stuff that she had to preserve for the winter. There was he no probably, other way. He probably got a lot of money by selling them, if you sell them. You don't sell them, you, you, you sell. make it for it your family. For your family. Food, otherwise we want to have food. As simple as it is. So she always did cucumbers, peppers, tomatoes, and um, she did the pe peppers. It's like peppers and tomato sauce. And I can go on and on and on and eat and I see their bored faces. Because I think they heard already this story at least a million times. And um, yes. We're not bored, we're just sleepy. Yeah. So, thank you so much for being with us again. Yay, thank and you. And coming back every day. So, listen to our stories. Yeah, thank you. And let me know what's your stories. 
yeah that's one by the way by the way this is one of the problems that i have with food because when you don't have it and you need to hunt for it you know you have your problems with the food yeah but yeah no you can't hear it really so yeah thank you for coming back for with us thank you for listening to our stories <gasps> sometimes relevant sometimes less relevant but yay and as usual check out our patreon account etsy shops subscribe to subscribe to his channel Yay. thank you thank you subscribe to our to our daily vlog channel family daily fun called yay yeah and don't forget to subscribe write us a comment thumbs up us and cheers live live, live. see you tomorrow see you tomorrow Come back for more. Loving life. Loving life. Loving life. Bye. Bye.